about Cocaine Bear? No, I haven't seen that, but that's hilarious. That's a true story. I heard that's a true story. Yeah, yeah. bears eat anything, man. The, the fact that the bear ate the coke. I wonder what it smelled like to him. I wonder why he ate it. Did it have? Did the bear die from a heart attack? I think that was the rumor. I, I mean, it probably overdosed. Yeah, like I mean, if you're eating coke and you're a bear, bears eat a lot. <laughs> like, you know, like how much coke is that? It's like, what did that taste? I bet the bear's mouth got numb as fuck. Yeah. Bro. And, and I bet every the whole the whole <laughs> snout. I bet they enjoy the experience. I bet it, I bet it feels good. I bet once you, you start getting high from that coke, you're like, oh, this is great. And then you're a bear, you're a glutton, so you're just diving in there, eating the whole bag. <laughs> How did the bear die? I'm looking right. Now. It happened in 1985. 85. <laughs> <85. laughs> the story. See, the that story was in 85. You're like, man, did the, that really happen? The story was is crazy. A, a plane dumped. Dumped the cocaine yeah. out. Bro, 75 pounds. They found the dead bear. Wow. Yeah, he had two of them. He absorbed th only three to four grams. Well, that's a lot. The yeah. Tax yeah, what do they think killed him? Oh, okay. His stomach was literally packed to the brim with cocaine. So wow. Yeah, he ate more than three to four grams. That seems like more than three to four grams. Only absorbed that much. Oh, he'd oh. only absorbed that. So the rest Into of it was in his stomach. Oh. So he literally ate until his stomach was packed like a big Coke rock. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> because that shit is probably hard as fuck. Coke He bear. probably packed it in there. In yeah. his guts. If his stomach was packed to the brim with cocaine, oh, my God. That's amazing. Wow. That's amazing. What was it like for that bear? Just lying there while your heart is literally cracking your ribs. <laughs> ba bang, ba bang, ba bang. Ba -bang. That, what the you, fuck that, have I done? That bear could not understand what the fuck was happening to him at all. You got a, a literal rock of paste in your stomach, oh, <laughs> and your heart is going. Da, 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 yeah, da, da, da. yeah. Imagine the heartbeat. <laughs> fuck. What a fucked up last day for a bear. Yeah. Oh. And then there was a movie that was supposed to be funny. I heard it was funny. Did you see it, Jamie? No, I haven't seen it yet. I don't yeah, know. I guess. I, I, I'll watch it someday. I, I thought it's about watching idea. it. I'm going to wait. It's a great idea. But it is. <laughs> when I heard it, I was like, nah, this, that can't be a movie. So and this is my question that I forgot earlier. Was is um, Does PCP make you aggressive? Because like, ketamine doesn't make you aggressive, right? It calms you down. So why do we always associate PCP with people being wild? I think that you, they have to be like sort of, it's like provocation. I think they're mellow until... Until provoked? Yeah. I don't want to try it, but... Like, I, I wouldn't want to be approaching anybody on PCP. No. Like, and telling them, hey, you need no. to... Like, nah. And who knows what designer drug some fucking chemist is going to figure out in the future. <laughs> yeah. That takes that to a next level. I mean, imagine if there was no... That's probably why I bet is uh, what does it maybe say? this... Uh, Dr. Edward D Domino, who participated in the early testing of PCP, documented that the drug produces an adrenaline release resulting in a fight-or-flight reaction <sighs> with an increased high, uh, heart, heartbeat, high blood pressure, and raised body temperature. Interesting. Hmm. He said that the effects of the drug, can, the drug can vary greatly. It can act as a depressant, stimulant, or hallucinogen, depending upon the dosage, type of administration, and circumstances of use. On the street, PCP is available as a powder, tablet, or liquid, or in leaf mixtures, it may be swallowed, injected, snorted, or smoked. Mm. Key factors that determine whether a PCP user becomes violent are the user's personality, the physical settings, and the external stimulants, like what you're saying. Yeah. Like, fucking with them. Yeah. Something fucks with them, and then they 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 go they, from zero to a hundred. They instantly. get triggered, yeah. It's, it it takes something to trigger them because I think they're totally in their own world until someone comes and yeah. And imagine that you're like in a zone, and then the cops come fucking with you. I mean, immediately you're gonna be reactive. It, they they cite the case of West Covina police officer Ken Bread, who was killed in 1983 by a PCP user who was unfazed by both mace and baton blows. In a power to, powerful display of force, he uprooted a sapling and its eight-foot stake, which he hurled at the officer. Then he managed to grab a shotgun out of the officer's car and kill him. Holy shit, dude. Damn. 
he pulled a tree out of the ground and threw it at the <laughs> that's, guy. That's brute that's fucking Hulk, strength. Hulk smash. That, that's Hulk smash strength. Like, right are we there. sure it doesn't make you stronger? Imagine if we had like MMA, but you could take PCP. You could take whatever drug you want. Hmm. I wonder if anybody's done weightlifting PRs on it. I wonder. It's a good question. About to check. Because dudes do weird shit before they do PRs. They drink. Sometimes guys do shots of uh, whiskey and yeah. they do deadlifts. Just something to give them a whoa, a fucking give, whoa. Give them that little boost. Yeah, I couldn't believe that when I heard that, that some people like to do that. I don't think like. Uh, that, that, I never heard that. That's, you never heard that? that yeah. A shot before they do, yeah. before they power lift, huh? Could be just crazy people. We should find that out too. I would imagine though, like you, you feel looser. Yeah. Like the, like some DJs before they go DJ clubs, they'll they'll have a shot and it makes them loose and they feel like they rock the part. They mm. got like the vibe of the party locked in. Yeah, and, a shot is a nice way to get the party started. Just like, whoa, just yeah. gets in there quick. The whoa, little joke, boom, little, whoa. warms the belly. Yeah, it sounds like people have definitely tried this. I'm reading a story right now. The one thing that says it's the most popular post off of a bodybuilding message board. The thread on PCP and bodybuilding and powerlifting. Oh, wow. It says a 6'5", 325 powerlifter came in high on PCP, 7% <laughs> body fat. I'm going on to see that there are 11 people piled in the back of an ambulance to try to keep him restrained. <laughs> yeah. Jesus Christ, dude. Yeah, imagine. Had to, they had to knock him down with sedatives. Oh, my God. <laughs> had to hit him with a dark oh gun. Oh, my God. <laughs> powerlifting on PCP. And just fucking roid raging around the building. Oh man! Probably PCP and steroids too. If he's oh, that yeah, big, yeah, yeah. yeah, you gotta imagine. So he's on. Try that. Oh my god! He's on the double dose. He's on the double whammy. That's you know, <laughs> like he 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 really thought that out. Like okay, I know I'm stronger when I smoke this PCP. I'm gonna go really get my workout on right now. Or maybe that was his first time. He just sorry guys, I didn't know. I took a chance. I fucked up. I was on PCP. Lost my mind. I mm. really apologize to everyone. <laughs> Let's hope. <laughs> do it deadlifts. Um, what about shots? Do pe people do do that? Well, right? I'm looking up deeper discussions on it. It says there's no evidence that it increases strength, but because it dis it's a disassociative, do you think that maybe you can't feel the pain? Yeah, probably. So you just go through it. And yeah, try could be. Yeah, pr there's a self preservation part of lifting, right? Like if a lift feels too heavy, you put it down. Maybe if you're on PCP, just fuck it. Yeah. Let's go. I mean, what's, you know. Well, uh, you know, hey, look, there's, that, that, there's parts of the mind <laughs> that we can't tap into in a sober state that give us different abilities, right? Including strength, you know, tapping into something different. We're blocked from it. Yeah, I think so. And I think some of these some of these things like PCP and others um, sort of maybe could unlock some of that. 